Charmers, we are here at South Mountain Creamery, an amazing dairy farm that actually services the Baltimore area. That's the reason we're here to explain a little bit about it today. So this is Peter, one of their marketing directors, and he's going to answer a couple of questions for us so that we can get plugged in with this great local product that we're going to bring to your home. Hey Peter, thanks for being with us. Thank you. So my first question today is, after everyone sees this gorgeous farm and the tour that we just took, and they want to buy your products, um, what are different ways that they can get in touch with your products? Uh, most people just go online, they'll sign up on our website for okay. delivery. What's that website? Uh, the website is uh, southmountaincream.com. Okay. Uh, we go there, we also do ice cream, which is South Mountain Ice Cream Diet. So that's a little bit different as well. Um, we're able to get our products here, obviously, at the farm. A lot of people come out, like yourself, do a tour, mm -hmm. uh, bring the kids out, walk around, look at feeds for calves, watch some cows getting milk. Uh, we do, on a regular basis, probably milk about 280 cows twice a day. Uh, you milk the cars you saw on the other side there. Uh, apart from that, from home delivery, we also do you know, sort of, uh, farmer's markets in the area, which is Jones, the Jones Farm Market, yeah, the Jones Expressway Farm. Market. Mm -hmm. Uh, we do that one on uh, we've got Saturday and Sunday. Okay. And then uh, there's a couple little places around town sometimes to time to get our products. Okay. Or if there's like a festival or a fair when they pull the trailer out and scoop ice cream and stuff like that. Cool. So let's talk a little bit about this home delivery. So as a busy mom, I love that thought. Tell me about it. For someone that's just no time on their hands, how can we get the product? brought to us at our home? Uh, some of us might remember, you know, as a kid or your know, grandma or maybe even your parents uh, would have the milk delivered to their homes in a, in a, in a milk box. And um, we've stuck with that. We actually do sell milk boxes that people can buy. Uh, a lot of people, just because of size and space and just efficiency or something, will get a large cooler okay. and we'll deliver to those coolers. Uh, for home delivery, it's a three dollar and seventy-five cent delivery fee, okay. and that gets the delivery to your home. Seems like a pretty low delivery fee. Well, that's that's for the stock. Okay. And then you can order cool. as little or as much as you want. We Love have, it. We have people that order a half gallon of milk a week. We have people that order ten gallons of milk. Awesome. So it just depends on you know what you want. There's cheese. There's there's glass bottle uh, dairy products. All the dairy, cream top, buttermilk, heavy cream, yogurt drinks, yogurt. You name it, our chocolate milk is really, really good. Mm. Uh, everything's just, I mean, it's it, it's an all-natural product, and you know, here's where you get it. You know, we milk the cows, uh, we raise all the, all the food that we eat and everything, and it's love them right here. My last question is, what separates, do you feel, your product from, say, I'm going to go to Sam's Club and I'm going to buy my milk? What's the difference? I think it's something like what you, what you had to experience today. You came out, uh, you are able to see the farm, you see the cows, the cows you see in the are, are supplying the milk that you're drinking. Mm. Uh, you get to see everything that's done here. The, the production's made here, the ice cream's made here. Very nice. You get to see the fields behind you where the crops are being grown. That's where the, uh, the alfalfa or the barley or the wheat or everything that's being done, the straw has been you know, harvested and chopped. You have to upkeep all that stuff. And that's why we have so many people here working like that. But the fact that it's made here and at any given time you're able to come out and bring your hand out. And, and what's the shelf life for your milk? Most of the milk is usually, I would say, about, about two weeks, okay. somewhere in that area like that. Great. Some of the eggs, too. Uh, I don't know if you had a chance to look at it, but we do have our new uh, chicken house. It's actually behind the shelf right here, up the top of the hill. And I think right now we're putting out around, I want to say, close to 8,000 eggs a day. Great. So really nutritious, good, fresh food that we're feeding our families. Awesome. Love it. Thanks so much, Peter, for having us out. Thanks, thanks City Charmers, out. look right below, click on the link, and be ready for this thank awesome you. product.